U.S. fans were screaming with revenge Monday after the U.S. beat the Ghana Black Stars, who eliminated the Americans from the last two World Cups. I, I had tears early on, and then when they scored, I, my heart dropped. And when, they, when the USA scored again, I didn't know what to think. I was sh shocked. I, I don't know. I'm still in shock that we won. The U.S. defeated Ghana 2-1, but it came at a steep price. Starter Yosi Eltador went out of the game with a hamstring injury. Team captain Clint Dempsey injured his nose in a fight for a header, and defender Matt Beasler went out with a strained hamstring. Dempsey would draw first blood of the game with an early goal, and John Brooks put it away by heading in a corner kick. Ghana's only goal of the game came from Andre Ayew after a brilliant backheel pass. Now the Americans are in good position in Group G after Germany trounced Portugal earlier in the day. Fan predictions of what happens next are varied, but most believe the U.S. team's momentum will carry them forward. Ghana and Portugal are dead. <laughs> That's it. That's it, man. Portugal had their key defender red card, another guy hurt. Josie's going to come back. We're going to bury him in Manaus. Germany's going to go through, and we are going to crush Portugal, and we're going through. That's what's happening. Odds favor advancement with a U.S. win, but it depends on which players Jurgen Klinsmann can field for Sunday's game against Portugal in the hot and humid Amazon rainforest capital of Manaus. In Natal, Brazil, Adam Pemble, The Associated Press.